What's good, YouTube? Episode 92, you're back again on again. And today, people, today we are here for episode number 38 of our brand new Pokemon Violet Let's Play here on the channel. In the last episode, you guys, we finally made it to Porto Marinara and hooked up with Kofu um, and won the auction for the Hoenn seaweed that he wants slash needed. Um... So if you missed out on that, definitely make sure you go back and check it out. Oh, and our starter evolved in the last episode too. Hot damn, hot fucking damn. Our incredible, awesome, juicy, spicy starter evolved my boy. He's all grown up. In today's episode, however, it is time finally we attempted to do this. What? How many episodes ago? How many episodes ago was this that we set out for this? Uh, 27? What? <laughs> Since episode 27, we have been trying to get to the water gym. That's what I'm trying to say. And in today's episode, we are finally taking on the motherfucking water gym. Damn it. So if you guys are hyped for today's episode, and of course, we're going to show you support as a parameter of the Diaby Nation. Make sure to like button down below for us because you already know your support is greatly appreciated. Yes, indeed. Our squad for today's episode, we have our Bolivar. Belly Bolt, Big Belly, Tinkatuff, Velusa, our Mighty Mighty Tauros, and Orthworm, um, Orthworm, Tauros, and Velusa. Um, we're still trying to get those three up to 35. Um, however, I think that they are also, they, they, I think they might be able to hold their own in the gym. It's a water gym, you know? They're not uh, weak necessarily. Velusa resists, and we can do a little bit back to it. Actually, you know what? I remember um, Tinkatuff is just tough. We're, we're taking her in there. We're really going to lean on our Bolivar and Big Belly Bolt here. Yo, by the way. Yo, by the fucking way. Dog, check out this Pokemon's fucking ability. Seed Sower turns the ground into grassy terrain when the Pokemon is hit by an attack. Oh, okay. Sure. Why the fuck do we need grassy terrain as a move then? That doesn't even make any sense. But we don't have anything else to teach her. I would really like it if she could get Hyper Voice. I hope she does get it by level up. Um, I did check the moves <laughs> on her and we don't really get anything for now. Um, I think I went through the TMs and either way, we just go keep rocking out with her. I love the way this Pokemon looks. I'm obsessed with it. I fucking love it. Big Belly is chilling down here, but I wanted to, uh, I brought up the moves because of the Lusa here, because I do remember that I taught it something. Drill Run. I taught it Drill Run. Why did I teach it Drill Run? For electric types. I saw it in the TM thing and I was like, okay, why not? Makes sense. <laughs> why not? Makes sense. We have Pluck for grass types, I guess, and Filet Away to fuck it up. Fuck it up, fuck it up, fuck it up. I hope we get Zen Headbutt or something soon. That'd be dope. Um, but anyways, Tauros and Orthworm, they're down here doing the damn thing as well, making shit happen. Of course, because you guys know that I live for the living decks, I did it, I did it, I did it, I did it, I did it. I went all the way. I went all the way. We do not have a single Pokemon in our PC right now that is not cataloged, <laughs> that is not in its place that it should be in. Um... It was actually a lot easier than I thought because I kind of just went one box at a time and like I would go through the Pokedex and be like, mm, okay, this is not like, like for example, like whatever comes after Loma Mola, I, I don't know off the top of my head, but like if it is something I've never seen before, then it's just not there. And if I don't have it, then I don't even need to click on the Pokedex entry. You know, I can count numbers between what I've registered and like what's the next thing I've registered. So. It was very easy to still remain spoiler free. We can just slap everything in here and we're good to go. I'm so stupid. In the last episode, I caught, not last episode, a couple episodes ago, I caught two of these Tynamos. There's another electric right there. I should have just caught the goddamn electric because it's a Thunderstone evolution. So what the fuck am I doing with it? I mean, I guess I could level the Tynamo up. It's level 40. It will fucking evolve, but either way. Either way. Um, but yes, turns out Tatsugiri is the last mon that I have registered in the decks. So I just stopped there. And then for the next couple boxes that we have here, we just have nothing, 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 nothing. Um, and then I kind of went a little overboard with the whole hotel theme. You know, I figured these are like room numbers, you know, everybody gets their own room. Then we have the lobby. We've been joking and chuckling about this is members only. 
VIP lounge. The only mods that end up in here are mods that are either in consideration for being on the squad or are on the squad. Look at our fucking boy! Look at this dude! Skeletor! Fuck yes, bro. Fuck yes. Fuck yes. Fuck yes, bro. Fuck yes. My boy Sko Villain. These are the VIP. This, this is the VIP of the members only up here. This top row. I really want to see what Knackle Stack evolves into. You know, I got high hopes for him. High hopes. High, high hopes. Um, and for Room, you know, I had my suspicions about his evolution because I was like, 32? What the fuck? Getting higher and higher. I think in the last episode, somebody said that he's another one of those thousand step mons. So very soon we'll get Varum, Varumin. And I guess we're going to get a Revavum, or maybe I will be surprised and there's another evolution between the two. But I don't know. I don't think there is. I'm trying to remember him in the decks. Mm, I don't know. Whatever. I really want to get a, a couple battles with my boy Houndstone as well. And Nihilate has been. <laughs> Brewing in the PC here, ready since we've evolved him. Finizen, we got to get a couple more levels. I'm very excited for Finizen's evolution um, as well. And Glamora, I got to get a chance to use. And you know, I got to find um, two more of the Glimits. Whatever the fuck them Glimits are. I got to find two more of them for the living decks because this one's on our squad. I really want to use this too. Like, it's fucking mortal spin. Get the fuck out of here. Anyways. More, uh, members only VIP and then we got the gimme gulag over here which after I ended up cataloging everybody we kind of just had this box which is gimme ghouls in it and I figured I don't know I've made it into my own little side quest in this let's play to snag all the gimme ghouls I can find so this they have their own box now it's the gimme gulag uh, and then I, I don't know what else to call I didn't want to say this is like the employees lounge or whatever but I I, I don't know, maybe offer some suggestions. This is our alternate forms box. Um, so give me suggestions, hotel themed suggestions for this, <laughs> for alternate forms. But I don't know what the fuck else to call it. So anyways, our PC had a little miniature makeover. Um, but I need to find a, another place for these two as well. Our shiny Mareep and this flying Pikachu I guess they've kind of just been chilling in the lobby because I didn't know what else to do with them but I don't know I need a box name for a special Pokemon as well Mons that I, I want to keep but I'm, I'm, I don't know anyways I know by now Pokemon from the outbreak have disappeared there are mouse, mass outbreaks coming what the fuck it should be in my immediate area when I open the map if it is any farther away, what? Wh where's the mass outbreak? <laughs> what? It's probably glitched. Anyways, we are here in Cascara Rafa to take on this boy Kofu. Somebody in the last couple of episodes called him Palladian Clay, and it's so accurate. It's so accurate. That's literally the vibe I get from him, and I fucking love it because I love Clay. So this might he might be my favorite gym leader. I don't know. Iona was pretty dope so far, but this is only halfway. We still have four more gym leaders to me. But all right, Kofu, me and our Bolivar. I don't know. I feel like Belly Bolt might be the real winner here because he might have some ice types. Sword Art Online, look at motherfucker. Well now, hell, oh, I mean, well now, Nappy. I don't say hello anymore. You appear to be progressing well on your gym circuit. What's this now? Is this the kid I've been hearing so much about? Oh wow, they give him hip swing mechanics. I, I don't think I've ever seen a Pokemon character do that before. What the fuck? Hey kiddo, I heard you're like way too good at battling, yeah? Say the girl. Hi baby. <laughs> uh yeah, hell yeah. Fuck yeah. Nah. You've got some spirit, big shot. This is a woman. <laughs> I guess that makes sense with oh, the hip swaying mechanics. Uh, I was gonna say, cause I thought it was a dude and that's why it caught me so off guard. I was like, why he's switching his hips like that? Not that I had any issue with it or anything, I mean, but still it makes more sense. But this would not be the first time that I have mistaken a girl for a boy in this game or a boy for a girl in this game. But that's anime for you. This, this, this young lady would be Rika. 
that's me, Rika, here at your service. Hey, and hey, I know I'm pretty, but no need to get intimidated or anything. She is a little <laughs> farcical, shall we say. But like myself, she is a member of the Elite Four. What? I wasn't trying to be funny. Anyway, hmm. Tell me something, kiddo. You look fun. Like, interesting. At a glance, anyway. Naturally, he is one of our Academy's esteemed students. Oh, haha. <laughs> yeah, that checks out. But the battles you'll face at these gyms really ratchet up the farther you go. Indeed, your average trainer abandons the challenge at roughly this very point. But you're not, right, kiddo? See, when you hit the champion assessment, you know you show these gyms what you've got. Best of fortunes to you. I'm very confused by everything that just happened. Everything, 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 everything. So, um, I didn't want to make the joke and say like, oh, just a member of the Elite Four. But I feel like every new person that we meet from here on out is, oh, I'm a member of the Elite Four. I'm a member of the Elite Four. I'm a member of the Elite Four. Save it. Leave it to the end. Like, kind of, maybe. I don't know. No, I feel like I've said the opposite in the past, where it's like, no, I, I want to be a character that means something. But still, I don't want you to just introduce us and then that's it. We don't see him again until the... I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I'm a little picky. Nappy, I heard you reunited Kofu with his wallet. I can't thank you enough. This... Though this is a little irregular, please consider your gym test passed. What do you mean? I've done two gym tests now. Are you ready to challenge gym leader Kofu, the surging chef? Oh, uh, yeah. Very well. Allow me to show you to the battle court. I'm excited. I'm really excited. I love water types. And Kofu is dope as shit. How do you take clay, and I love ground types, and then you make him into a water type trainer? Like, what the fuck, bro? Come on. 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 Ooh, and this fucking arena is dope too. You're not Kofu. Are you Kofu's mama? I'm mad he didn't come in on like a tidal wave or something. Oh man, Kofu, play with us. Come on. <laughs> I would be honored if you would try a new. Oh, that's not him. <laughs> I would be honored if you would try a new item for my restaurant's menu as well. Sorry, everybody. I've got some business to take care of as gym leader real quick like. I'm keeping somebody waiting, you see. Please forgive me. I need to do this first. Okay. Damn, bro. Look at this motherfucker right here, dog. Big man on campus. Hey, you. Step right up. I've been waiting for you. Thanks for the help over in Porto Marinata. You did a mighty fine job. And now that I've got that legendary seaweed, I can make some real quality dishes with it. He's like a... Pokemon's version of Leatherface. What the hell? But don't expect me to go easy on you in your battle here. All he's missing is a chainsaw. Give me a chainsaw. At the auction, we battle with buying and selling. At my gym, we battle in a more traditional sense. Moves and tactics ever-changing as the raging sea. I'm going to serve you a full course of water-top whoop-ass. Don't try to eat them, though. Oh, well. Pokemon. <laughs> Don't you dare try to eat that ass. All right, Kofu. Let's get it, boy. Belusa. Ah, I hope it doesn't click black on me. I feel a bit indebted to you, but don't expect me to go easy on you just because of that. Come on, bruh. Whoa, I like this, this, uh... Hmm, yeah. Look at my olives. Check out, check out my olives. I'm olived up. Mm -hmm. olive, 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 olive. Go ahead, hit me. Hit me. Oh, he put... <laughs> He's super effective. Look at that grassy terrain immediately. Hey, bro, fuck your water. Fuck your water, dog. One of these days, Pokemon, one of these days. Oh, shit. I didn't even see what... Oh, shit. Okay, our Bolivar. Damn. God damn. 
Yes! Yes! Fucking... I love this Pokemon! Wug Trio? No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Little Wug Trio. Okay, wait, hold on, time out. Level 29. I mean... They're, they're catching up to us. What can I say? They're catching up to us. Actually, let's let's let homegirl shine right now. Let's let homegirl shine. Go ahead, do your thing. Do your thing. I don't think we've really used our Bolivar since we snagged her. Since we snagged her, since we evolved her. Oh my goodness, what a Pokemon! Come on! What a Poke- it's a whole tree! Like, what the fuck? A Pokemon that I would love to see have a Mega Evolution or a Gigantamax form definitely would be. We got another crit. Did we get like a scope lens or something? Is she holding that? That's two crits in a row. Our Bolivar is not playing. Crabominable? What? So he's gonna have a water type Crabominable? The time's ebb and flow. It's time for a raging tidal surge. Abominable. I mean, it's very fitting. It looks like he, if if he had to get somewhere quickly, he would just pop out a Crabominable and just ride it as it skitters down the street. Actually, I feel like Crabominable would like skitter and like run like a <laughs> like a gorilla at the same time. <laughs> I don't think he would just skitter with his big ass hands in the air the whole time. You know, I feel like it would be like a mixture, like boom skitter. Boom, skitter. Boom, skitter. I'm gonna stop. Sorry. Go ahead, our Bolivar. Prepare the Reagan for a big transformation. My Pokeball's gonna rock the boat. Oh. Oh. Whoa. Go ahead. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wow! Hey, I gotta say, bro. Uh, we took on a water type Garchomp. <laughs> that motherfucker ran in us, dog. You don't know terror until a shark can chase you out of water onto land and back in. <laughs> but you're just a water type now, though. You should have stayed the type that you were. Pow! Woo! Oh, I wanted that to be three for three crits in a row. Damn. Sorry, buddy. Sorry, dog. Sorry. I'm sorry. This R. Bolivar. She she just been in the PC ready. You know what I mean? Like, red. B. Vaulting the loser, you're a lively one, aren't you? A little too lively, if I do say so myself. Fuck yeah, bitch. Fuck you mean, dog. I, I didn't load this game up to lose. I didn't load this game up to, to struggle, Kofu. I want you to know that I am vastly beyond your capabilities. The law is as refreshing as the air at the morning market. I'm just like a helpless little Magikarp to you, eh? Fucking around all willy-nilly. You got me good, I tell you. What a great catch you are. Just like a master fisher, you held on tight to the last second and reeled in victory. Now it's time to hand over a gym badge to you. And let's get a real good photo together using a pose I've been wanting to try out for a while now. Oh, God, what's he going to do? Ah! Definitely favorite gym leader. And look at them shoes. Them clean white ass shoes, dog. Whole fit is on point. What the hell? But that is four gym badges now. With four gym badges in your possession, Pokemon of up to level 40 will be easier to catch and listen to you when you ask them to do things. Let me throw this in too as an extra special bonus. I'm sure you're keen to make good use of it. Chilling water? Oh, is this the move that you want to use on me if I want your hand? <laughs> oh, okay. The user attacks the target by showering it with water that's so cold, it saps the target's power. This also lowers the target's attack stat. Um, what? So it's just a water type move that lowers attack stat, or does it lower PP? The, it lowers the target's power. Does that, it, does that convey to lowering the target's attack stat? Because it says this also lowers the target's attack stat. So it lowers their PP power? And the entire stuff? I don't know. We'll see. All right. It's about time I headed on back to my restaurant. Got to prepping for the next wave. You come back to see me again now, you hear? Hey. 
Thank you, Kofu. I, it was a wonderful, wonderful battle. I had a great time. Thank you, dog. Appreciate it. You really let our bully bus shine. <laughs> you really did. But if she had a hyper voice, that'd be it. It'd be game up. Oh, shit, pneumonia. I ain't, I ain't seen you in a while, girl. Oh, Navi. Hola. Got you just as you finished off in here, huh? Nice work. That push you four badges in now, right? Man, that's awesome. I can't believe you're already halfway through your gym journey already. See, your efforts are bearing so much fruit so quickly. It makes me want to just challenge you to a battle right here, right now. But I'm going to have to wait. Because I put together my team of Pokemon specifically to take on the gym leader. <gasps> Dang it. When I battle you, I want to do it under the best possible conditions. Which means this time I've got to ask for a rain check. Ah, this is the worst timing ever. Lo siento, Navi. Forgive me. Forgive me. Perdóname. Perdóname. Okay, hey, thanks. All right, well, this was dope. So guess what's next? So, um, a lot of you guys have been mentioning, mentioning, saying, hey, by the way, 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 by the way. Hey, look this fucking game in, dog. Find your frames and let's go. Um... By the way, we need to go and oh god damn it, we need to go and peep the Iron Treads Titan because he's supposed to leave the area and come back. And admittedly, I did never go back and check. Like I remember thinking about it when I started the episode after that, um, and I was like, uh, well, whatever, it's not here. I'll come back later. And then you know, <laughs> you know what happened from there? <laughs> we had our own little arc. <laughs> Of us just absolutely doing everything and anything before going to Puerto Marinada. But I was honestly, I would have to say, probably the Asado Desert has been top five moments so far. And I cannot wait to come back and climb that thing either, or any of this shit, actually. But I'm gonna go check him out since we're here and I can remember. How you doing, dog? What you looking at? Then y'all gotta be staring at me like this. You act like you ain't never seen me before. You act like you ain't never seen a trainer before. Uh, Spot Blue? No, no, no. I'll just take that. 500 LP. Hell yeah. Love having that much. Stardust just because. Just fucking because. You can sell it. What is this again? It's a Sandy gas. A Sandy Weasel? I don't think so, Sandy. Whoa! No, no, no. Yo, where's this? Uh... Oh, it's over here. Whoa, yes, big dog. Hold on. We ain't got one of you yet. No, 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 no. Whoa, it's level 55. That's kind of high. Our Bolivar, you might get smacked up. Our Bolivar, you might get smacked up. But let's see what we got here. Let us see what we got here. We got one Ultra Ball. You think it's worth it? You think it's worth a try? Do you think it's worth a try? Do you think we're catching this level 55 Braviary at full HP? Critical capture? Ooh. Ooh. Um, honestly, it's our, our, our bully though. Yo, there's a fucking power attack! Is this because we just beat the gym leader? Now stronger mods are showing up? Yo, I gotta catch that power on too. That'll save us so much fucking time. Hold on, dog. Uh, we doing this. We doing this. Don't you worry. Don't you worry. I know this grassy terrain is a bitch. Yo, I want that fucking pout on. Yo, whoa, wow, whoa, whoa. How the fuck we outspeed this bravery here? How? Make it make sense. Are you shitting in my throat? My Pokedex has been updated. That's cute. Come here. That's fucking adorable. My Pokédex has been updated. Look at these two little gangsters pulling up on us. <laughs> what you doing? <laughs> I don't have an Ultra Ball for you. Yo, you're pretty weak, dog. Check it. Now I wish I had our Bolivar. Oh! <laughs> you know, that would have been fucking wild. My jaw would have hit the ground. Ugh. Okay. 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 For what it's worth, we're gonna we're gonna 
keep hit, keep hitting and keep hurting yourself. I'm just, I'm just happy we just didn't get rocked by a ground type move like an earthquake or some shit. Uh, but you know what's crazy? I, I can swear somebody told me that Belly Bolt could get Surf or something like that, and I tried to teach it with a TM. Belly Bolt does not learn Surf, so does he learn? Can I get at least Bubble Beam? Cause, I mean, you know I'll rock out with Bubble Beam any day of the week. Check out this fucking down-ass Hippowdon, dog! Yes, please! Oh, we just need to find a Lady... A Lady Don. This is the Sir Powdon. It brandishes its gaping mouth in a display of fearsome strength. It raises vast quantities of sand while attacking. Alright, bro. Thank you for helping out the cause. Shout out to you. So does this mean, yo, that changes my entire perspective of the game. Maybe, mayhaps, someone might have left that as a comment on a video and I might have missed it, but if that is a thing, like, the more badges you get, like, you can go back to later areas and find the evolved versions of Mons. Because, I mean, we spent a pretty significant amount of time in the Asado Desert. Like, uh, I would say we did. <laughs> I think we spend a pretty significant amount of time in every area that we go to in this game. Look at this fucking little... This fucking little gang meetup. We all trying to jump this flittle? Oh shit, bro. Yo, don't eat my soul! Does he only move when you're not watching? <laughs> oh boy, I hope there's no scarecrows that get. Wait, he just don't move at all. Whatever, bro. Maybe at nighttime they chase you. I'm being distracted. I'm being distracted. Excuse me. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Oh, here he is! Hey, buddy! What you up to, dog? What you been up to? Um. So he's, what, steel? Ground? I think? I know he's steel. Fuck it, our bully well, let's do it. Uh, hey, bro, can we talk? Can we. Can. We ho ho hold on. Hey, dog. Whoa, 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 no, get your ass back here. I clicked R to save, and I was like, shit, wait, no, the menu's not up. I'm gonna save my game real quick. Um, hey, bro, it'd be really cool to catch whatever the fuck this thing is. So let's do it. Oh, you're really just this tiny, dog? Iron Treads. So this Pokemon is called Iron Treads. Look at this bitch. He looked pretty weak to me. Get in this fucking nest ball, bitch. How'd I make you feel? That's what I think of you. Turn one. Or why? What the fuck are the Jew and Rapid Spin, dog? Oh, oh, that's what the Jew and Rapid Spin. All right. All right, look at that. I got it. was a pretty good turn one for him. <laughs> uh -huh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, bro. What you think about this? Holy shit. Our Boliva. What is this game you playing, girl? Yo, he just laid us. How many turns has it been? Has it been enough? <laughs> has it been enough? Can we uh, use a timer ball yet? Dang, he is not playing no games, bro. He boosted his speed. All right, do it again, bitch. Is 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 this is this actually an NPC doing this? What are the odds? This is the situation we end up in. Um. Okay, bro. Check this out. Check this out. Let's find out if you're just pure steel or steel ground. Has no effect. He's steel ground. Uh, wow, I'm gonna one shot him. Oh, wow. Never mind. He's gonna whoop our ass. Dog, bro. Hold up, bro. Who do you think you are, bro? Using my grassy terrain against me, bro. Stomping tantrum? This is what we gonna do? Uh, yo, that's stomping tantrum is kind of bananas 
Um, yo, check it out. Fuck yes, let's hit it up. Let's hit it up. Lelusa, I'm counting on you right now. I am very thoroughly, very heavily counting on you right now to win this battle for us. Look, you look so party with that, that, that water crown on your head. Oh, yes, you do. You just do. Oh, when he look for Iron Head. Yo, don't don't fall for it. Velusa. Uh, Velusa, don't let this happen again. Don't let this happen again. There you go. Not as much as I wanted, uh, to be honest. Okay, on the off chance that he doesn't go for Stomping Tantrum, uh, we won't heal the fuck out of Elusa right now. Oof. We are, we are bordering such a tricky part of the game. You know, last couple episodes, we were fighting level 50s, we fought level 65 Garchomp. Hey, right, here we are. Knock off, bro. What the fuck? Dog, why are you wasting people's time? Oh, it's not gonna be enough. Why did I do that? Why did I do that? Iron Head, we can live two Iron Heads. It's the Stomping Tantrum on the sea. Oh my goodness. Uh, yo, 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 yo. Can we stop doing that? <laughs> like that shit you just did, bro? Can we not do that? Hey, yo, Dolphin, what the fuck you looking at? Look at all these motherfuckers staring us down, dog. That's what I wanted to see. Oh, never mind. <laughs> Take that back. I ain't want to see that, dog. I ain't want to see that. I ain't want to see that, bro. I ain't want to see that at all. Okay, so the Stomping Tantrum whoops our ass. I'm pretty sure it'll whoop everybody else here, too. Um, so, I think I'm going to go for a double kick real quick. I should have fucking... Oh, I forgot he has Intimidate. Oh, uh, you know what? I am a dumb dumb sometimes. That would have saved us so much time. Ooh, and we ate that Stomping Tantrum, too, especially after the Intimidate. Ooh, wee! Yo. Run that back. Don't you dare. I was about to say, don't you dare. Hell yes! Toro's coming through! Uh, Toro's. And I know it's been enough turns now. And the timer ball is actually kind of dope because it kind of sort of matches them too. Not really, not to a T, but it could be an accessory. Ooh, 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 ooh. Add another one to the decks. Yo, but I might have to check this Iron Treads out though. He's level 45. But he's not going to listen to us. The homeboy just said level 40 is our cap. The Paradox Pokemon. Sightings of this Pokemon have occurred in recent years. It resembles a mysterious object described in the old expedition journal. Wow. Ground steel. Wow. Oh, Gimme Ghoul is that late in the Pokedex? I didn't fucking uh, add him, I don't think. Uh, yo, so check this out. I'm gonna be 100% honest with you right now. I want to find that Braviary again. <laughs> oh! Wait, 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 Braviary. Yo, don't do nothing, don't do nothing. Don't do nothing, Braviary. Yeah, bring your ass over here. Bring your ass over here, dog. Up, 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 up. Come here, bro. Come here, bro. You're literally making my day right now. Fuck it up, hit him again, hit him again. He level 56, ooh, wee. Why are you like this, bro? Why? Why? You literally have to choose to be this way. You have to choose that move. This is like the hairy mama all over again. And now that I know... Now... How did I miss this? Now that I know that the Braviary is here, it's gonna bother me. All I'm gonna wanna do is come back here and get the fucking Braviary. Ah! 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 Okay, so 
I'm gonna make one quick sweep through this desert area real quick just on the hunt for a little braviary or action or something uh, so I'm guessing if Rufflet and Braviary are in this game that Vullaby and Mandibuzz <laughs> Mandibuzz are in Scarlet so I'll have to add that to the list I haven't even seen them in the decks like that but I'll have to check them out oh wait a minute speaking of checking things out Iron Treads. Quark Drive. What the fuck is Quark Drive? Boost the Pokemon's most proficient stat on electric terrain or if the Pokemon is holding booster energy. Ooh. Quark Drive. He's a special defense boosting attack lower. I feel like that's a really bad nature for him. Naughty? Yeah. I feel like that's a really bad nature for him. But it's okay, buddy. It's okay. You're special. You're special to me. You're special to me, buddy. You are a Titan. You are from Area Zero, apparently. Yo, where the fuck y'all keeping the Braviaries out here? I like that bird, but that's not the bird I'm looking for. Ooh, I definitely want to check that uh, ruins area. What? What? It, yeah. 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 Um, so, yeah. I'm going to make a quick pass through there, and then I want to go back to Porto Marinada because there was one thing that I said I wanted to do in the last episode, and we just totally didn't do it. Like, we ended the episode. I never came back and talked to this guy? No, because we haven't been back to Cascarafa until today. Because we went, we spent, yo, know, the fucking. Oh my god, the Cascarafa, I don't know what to call if to call this the Cascarafa arc or the Porto Marinada arc. Can we have sub arcs within arcs? <laughs> Ooh, yo, let me talk to you real quick, bro. Hell yeah, but have some dope ass battles. Hello there, I'm a Pokemon League rep. Seven trainers in the Asado Desert. What is my prize? <gasps> Earthquake! I remember somebody mentioned that like way back before Zappa Pico. Dope, dope, dope. What a great TM. Do we have anybody that could greatly benefit from that now? I feel like there's always somebody. There's always somebody that could benefit from knowing Earthquake. Really? We don't really have anybody? I mean, Claude's are, but is a little more of a. Uh, no, I guess he's more physical attack. Yeah, Earthquake would be great on Claude's are. Um, Toad School, he's more of a special attacker. Toad School, sorry, apologize, 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 apologize. Um, but anyways, I think we're going to stick with our squad as it is now because uh, we have everybody at 35. I'm sure you know that. <laughs> um, so we're going to get, I guess, the party that we have up to 40. And then we're going to swap in some of uh, these other mons and get them up to 40 as well as we are chug-lugging along. Um, but yes. Next, we're gonna head. We're just, we're just pretty much gonna head to Porto Marinada on foot. That's the best way I can say it. Um, and the reason is, if you missed out on the end of the last episode, you know, that's why I say it at the start of the episode. If you missed out on the last episode, definitely make sure you go back and check it out. <laughs> um, reason being, we have been hunting down this special Tauros. And, you know, I've had some people leave comments saying, like, oh, you know, that was the Tauros right there. Uh, here's the timestamp. I mean, shout out to those of you guys that do leave timestamps. Because if you leave a comment saying something like that, I just have no fucking idea what, what you're, what or when or where you're talking about. Like, I don't know. I don't, I don't know. Give me that. Yeah. Always taking give me ghoul. Um, but anyways, um, I don't think any of the references I've seen so far have been the Tauros because I don't know I'm expecting like some wild and crazy shit you know wait I caught another Tinker Tuff right I need to catch another Tinker Tink for the living decks this is perfect right on time damn I used up all my nest balls too fuck look at how proper this olive tree this, this olive branch is just look at you go oh wait I still hear another gimme ghoul Oh, I forgot about that one under there. <laughs> okay, look, little Tinka Tink. I got this uh, great ball with your name on it. Because <laughs> I remember catching a Tinka Tough outside of Zalapico on that ledge. 
fuck yes. Don't we just love it when it's easy like that? But anyways, no brave areas over here. We're gonna snag the gimme ghoul and zoom through here. And then we're gonna pick up whatever that chocolate crepe was or whatever. And maybe do a little Tauros hunting in today's episode. Um, actually, I wonder if... I want to see if there's anything down here now that we are experiencing larger Pokemon. I haven't even looked at my list. What this is? You tell me what that is. What that is? A sun crown? Isn't sun crown, is sun crown by level up or is sun crown a stone evolution? Um, I can check it out in a little bit, but I think Rufflet is above 300. I think Sunkern and Sunflora are too. Actually, I think I have both Sunkern and Sunflora. <laughs> now that I'm thinking about it, fuck that. I'm not doing that. Oh look, we got some Tauros right here. If I just hold it, we go straight down, right? Oh. So, all these Tauros look the same to me. I don't notice anything different with their horns. I don't notice anything different with their tails. Um, oh, and you guys were telling me, yeah, 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 Giraffe Rig apparently does have a new evolution in this game, and apparently it's got a certain move. So, did I catch two Giraffe Rig? If I caught two giraffe rig, then I don't need to catch another one. But, I mean, I'm being stupid right now. <laughs> Just stop. <laughs> right now, I have to go check. Let me go see my fucking giraffe rig. Like, I don't even know what number it is. No, I don't have two giraffe rig. Okay. Well, if it evolves, I'm gonna need a second one. So, come here, dog. Talk to you real quick. Is that Lonely Tauros? Is that the one over there? Is that, is that the Tauros we're looking for? Yo, hop in this ball, dog. Can I use a die ball on you? Because it's raining. Imagine. Can we get a ball for every weather? Can I get a, 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 a hail ball? A snowball? A, a rain ball? Thank you, thank you, thank you. I love it when the squad levels up. Mm-hmm. Okay, so we'll have to we'll, we'll we'll investigate giraffe rig further here soon. Here, this is what I will do so that I do not forget. I will take this giraffe rig that we just caught, and oh shit, we put him in this box. What the fuck, everything up? I'm gonna put him over here, members only, so that we can remember to pay close attention to him. I don't know what move it is. Maybe we'll we'll figure it out later. We'll figure it out later. I, he is there as a reminder. You know what I mean? Not a me. What you doing over here, Cyclops? What you doing? What y'all doing? What y'all doing? What y'all doing over y'all? What y'all doing over y'all? What y'all doing over y'all? Um, okay, so we're gonna. I guess we skipped out on the Braviary thing. We can always go back. <laughs> Ended up coming down here, and I'm started talking about the Water Type Tauros. So here we go, Water Type Tauros time it is. So I know up here on this ledge they spawn. I know in this whole area they spawn. Um, a lot of people recommended that I do it in La Vincia, but I think that this will work here too. Uh, I don't know anything about any of these food powers or anything. I haven't tried it, tried it before, but I'm going to attempt it now. Encounter power water. I think that's what we're supposed to have. I'll pay with cash. Can you stack them? Or do you only get... I think they work for 30 minutes. But like this is level one. How do I get level two? Do I have to go catch water Pokemon, or do I have to go encounter water Pokemon to level it up? Oh yes. Mmm. Wow. God damn. Oh my god. Oh wee. Encounter power water level one. I just want to see. It still says level one. Okay. 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 Taking note. Taking note. Taking note. Taking note. Taking note. Uh, so, oh look, there's a yaw up here. <laughs> Imagine if they ever gave Ditto an evolution. Ditto. 
What would they call it? Oh, I actually, I need to catch a another tandem mouse because apparently tandem mouse has another form. You can get a rarer evolution that has just one baby. So it's a family of three. And you know, we're doing a living deck, so we got a, a box for forms. And we got to have the rare form with just the, the family of three. So uh, even if we have this tandem mouse, it doesn't guarantee that we get it. We could we might have to get a whole squad of tandem mouse, but it's good to know that they spawn up here. Not that I couldn't just check the decks, but still, it's good to know that they spawn up here. But we'll just have to pop them in the party. And hope and pray. <laughs> One of them gives us a single baby and we have a family of three they should have three of them then they should have a family oh you whore let me be i can't get away what do you mean this battle <laughs> you had fun did up you had fun you wanted that one turn bro didn't you I was really excited to snag two tandem mouse back to back like that. I was like, wow, that's really convenient. Chick eating an apple. Oh, uh, okay, wait, let me refocus. Toros, Toros, Toros. Where you at, Toros? I think you up here. Whoa. Wait a minute, is that, is that it right there? Look at his horns. And look at the tail. Is that really on the ah! Ah! Come here, boy! Haha, -ha, I was like a matador. So what is what is this? What is this? Ooh, I see you, big dog. Okay, look at them horns. Look at the the, the pelt or the mane or the what, what whatever the fuck, dog. Yo, that's dope. So he's a water type. I'm understanding that correctly. He's a water type. So this dive ball should work, right? <laughs> so he's water fighting? They made a water fighting Tauros? <laughs> I knew that that was easy button. Well, that was easy. After all these episodes, lauding over this legendary Tauros, we buy one fucking chocolate banana crepe and boom, Tauros. Fighting water. Yo, they just said fuck normal Tauros. Fuck normal Tauros entirely. It swims by jetting water from its horns. The most notable characteristic of the aqua breed is its high body fat, which allows it to float easily. Wow. Fighting water Tauros. So is the Scarlet version fighting fire? Yo, this happens way too much. I feel like I'm way too high level. I don't want to. I don't want to talk about speed stats anymore. Simple fact of the matter is, is that my Pokemon is stronger than theirs. I don't think a lower level Pokemon should be telling me whether I can or cannot run from a battle. How does that lower my speed even more? Bro, you're killing me, dog. You're killing me. You're killing me. You're just killing me, dog. You're killing me. But that's dope. <laughs> I like that it was honestly that easy just to encounter and scoop up. We got another form added to the living decks. And we ain't got to worry about that no more. Um, I actually need to catch another Don Spars, too, now that I think about it. Um, that's another mod that you guys have said has an evolution. I don't really know how it evolves, though. But everybody else has been cooperative, so Dunsparce, how about it? How about it? I see the fucking shadow of your tails. Leave me the fuck alone, dog. Thank you, Dunsparce. Shout the fuck out to you, bro. I'm not trying to jinx it, but who needs a repeat ball? Who needs a... Yo, it's another one of them water Tauroses. What? Get the fuck out of here, bro. What? Do I catch it? Should I catch it? No, it's not the right one. Yo, what in the fuck? Where did it go? That's not him. Oh, he's over here. Hey, bud. Hey, bud. Hey, bud. How are you? Hey, bud. How are you? Did the one that we have, did it have Intimidate? 
don't know if it had Intimidate or not. I'm gonna see if I can die ball this one too. Oh, you whore. Why, why must you act this way? Explain it to me, bruh. Uh, well, I mean, I don't know if we're gonna use the water Toros. I mean, I'm like, I'm liking, I'm liking the, the regular Toros that we have so far, but I don't know if I like. I like his design better, but I'm still kind of leaning towards Finizen at the moment for, um, like, leading water type on the squad. I mean, I don't know. I need to check out that Tatsugu Tatsugiri Tatsuguri because I wouldn't mind having Water Dragon too. I wouldn't be pissed at that either. But I don't know, there's I'm I'm juggling a lot of different mods in my head right now. In my head right now, in my head right now. Um but I'm 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 I'm, I'm over this. I'm over these Tauros. Get it, get it gone. I wanna be gone. Look at all these Tauros in my ass. No dog, no. No. Swiper, no swiping. <laughs> no, 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 no. Is that another one? Yo, that's crazy. That all we had to do was just eat a fucking crepe, and now all of a sudden, these big badass boss ass Toros want to show up all over the place. Hey, fuck you guys. How about that? Did I ever get that Gimme Ghoul coin at, in the ruins up here? I don't think I did. That was 30 fucking Gimme Ghoul coins. I don't think I did go get that Gimme Ghoul. Um, hey, how y'all doing? It's, I know it's a little dusty, a little windy right now. But I, you know, I was just uh, going around through here trying to see if there's maybe a. Uh, oh no, not you! Not you! I, I'm looking for the the the. We still need to get another. Hippowdon, a lady don. Ooh. Oh dang! That brave is gonna drive me crazy. That's like Harry Mama on crack. Harry Mama whirlwinded us once. This Braviary has whirlwinded us twice. And I'm not a fan of that. It's gonna drive me crazy. It's literally going to drive me mad. And now everything but the Braviary wants to spawn. Every item but a Braviary wants to spawn. Yo, this is bananas. The amount of... Hey, bitch. Came back here just for you! Yes, indeedy. Yo, show me where the Braviary's at. Is, is he hiding? Oh, it breaks my heart. Oh, it breaks my little Dex heart. My little living Dex heart. All right, Braviary, I get it. Ah, it's not worth it. I don't want to get into the battle. Ah, ah, ah yeah, little whore. You're not stopping me. Well, okay. Fuck him then. <laughs> Fuck him then. <laughs> if that's how you feel. Okay, so, well, I don't know. I guess that'll have to be uh, another plan another time. There's a mass outbreak up here. Of Tauros. Where? This is Cascarafa, but we'd have to go down here and all the way up here. Because we've never been here before on top of here. I'd love to try. It's a mass outbreak. We'd have to get the, the shiny potion food. Food, food? <laughs> A shiny potion. <laughs> Anyways, I think I'm going to wrap up today's episode here. I love wrapping up episodes at the exact same Pokemon Center that we started them at. Don't you? We're going to wrap up today's episode here. <clears throat> In the next episode, I need to see what are we, what objective are we headed to next? We kind of wrapped up a few loose ends over here uh, on this side of the region in today's episode. But I think the next goal that we have in mind is Team Star's Poison Crew. Which, if I'm not mistaken, is way the fuck over there. It was by Zapapico. So we're headed right back over there! Woo! But we don't have to explore anything, right? 
We have nothing to explore. We can literally just do it next. We should be good to go. Right, 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 right. But anyways, that's going to be our goal for the next episode. I like that everyone is leveling up. We got four badges now. Um, let's peep it. Let's fucking peep it. Show me. Victory row, four of eight. Starfall Street will be three of five after the next episode. And we only have one Path of Legends left. Wow. Wow, we're doing a lot, catching a lot, and getting a lot done. Anyways, if you guys enjoyed today's episode of Pokemon Violet, and of course, I'm going to show you support as a part of the Nappy Nation, make sure to like the button down below for us, because you already know your support is greatly appreciated. And until next time, thank you so much for your living light, and be safe. I'm out this bitch. Bye!